uh, despite the decentralized nature of cryptocurrencies, authorities have, in the past, made several seizures of cryptocurrencies. Uh, this time around, a recent filing by the Federal Bureau of Investigation uh, revealed that uh, the agency confiscated uh, close to uh, $1.7 million uh, worth of crypto between March and July this year. Ethereum, uh, the second largest cryptocurrency by market cap at Cowan for the most crypto seizures. The filing showed uh, the FBI uh, seized $800,000 worth of Ether as well as Bitcoin, 147,000 uh, DAI, uh, $420 in Doge, 220,000 free, and uh, DAI, uh, $469, uh, DAI, $69. According to the agency, uh, these seizures are for federal forfeiture for violating certain federal laws. States like Florida and Virginia accounted for the most confiscated uh, crypto assets. The FBI, uh, however, uh, also confiscated assets from other states, including New York, Missouri, North Carolina, Michigan, New Jersey, Louisiana, Georgia, California, Arizona, Ohio, Oklahoma, Pennsylvania, and Illinois. Uh, the FBI notably confiscated 428.5 ETH, from the Eastern District of Virginia. Uh, this figure accounts for the most seizure uh, made by the agency so far. Close to 463,000 of ether uh, was seized uh, from a particular source uh, in the state. Uh, meanwhile, when I was mentioned, won't surprise many, uh, considering that the token's privacy features have long uh, been seen as an allure for many users, including those looking to, to, to carry out illicit activities. The token has been known to be used in illicit activities like money laundering, crypto jacking, and other organized crime. As highlighted in the filing, the crypto assets were confiscated from various sources. However, a huge chunk of these seizures came from several accounts in the world's largest crypto exchange, Binance. Uh, cryptocurrencies weren't the only assets seized as the FBI also made seizures from bank accounts that held fiat currencies, uh, cars and luxury items also formed a lot of items, but the agency also seized. The law enforcement agency has become more conscious of uh, the criminal activities going on in the crypto industry, and it has uh, continued to take steps to prevent and clamp and down on illicit activities in the space. In 2022, it launched a crypto-focused unit to monitor activities in the space following notable seizures related to the Colonial Pipeline and Bitfinex hacks. As part of its efforts to curb crypto scams, the FBI recently warned about the rise in fraudulent job advertisements. Remember the Southeast Asia, according to the agency, victims of this scam are coerced into participating in their fraudulent crypto investment operations.